Since the traditional fuel mining truck came out, it has quickly become popular around the world with its super performance. However, with the transformation and upgrading of the global energy structure, the limitations of fuel mining trucks, especially in terms of environmental protection and energy efficiency, have become increasingly obvious. For this reason, a Chinese company has been studying the application of new energy technologies in large mining trucks since 2018. By 2019, China had taken the lead in launching the world's first medium-sized 100-ton pure electric mining truck and successfully put it into mining operations. But this year, China has made a new breakthrough. They have successfully developed the first large-scale pure electric mining truck with a load capacity of an astonishing 220 tons. This news immediately attracted global attention. Among them, British media reported that major international mining giants have shown great interest in China's electric mining truck. This electric mining truck, independently developed by China, is likely to become a new benchmark in the industry and is even expected to surpass similar products in traditional European and American powers. So, how powerful is this electric mining truck? Why can it lead Europe and the United States on the basis of a load capacity of 220 tons? If you like our video content, please click to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you can receive all our latest video content. Now, let's get into today's topic. Climate change has become increasingly evident in our daily lives, and one of the main reasons is the overuse of fossil fuels. It has led to global warming and triggered more extreme weather events. According to the International Energy Agency, global carbon dioxide emissions reached a staggering 36.3 billion tons in 2021, and by 2023, this figure hit a new high, increasing to 37.4 billion tons an increase of 1.1 billion tons in just two years. At the same time, as global energy demand continues to grow, traditional fossil fuel resources are gradually depleting, and the problem of tight energy supply is becoming increasingly apparent. Against this backdrop, countries around the world have set carbon neutrality goals and accelerated their transition to renewable energy. For example, the European Union plans to make green energy supply account for 45% of energy demand by 2030, becoming one of the leaders in global energy transformation. However, behind the energy transformation of these countries, there is a key role that cannot be ignored that is China. Although China's carbon neutrality goal is set at 2060, it seems to be progressing slower than some countries. But this is mainly due to China's large population base which makes it more difficult to achieve this goal. However, China's role in the global energy transition is still crucial. First of all, China's technological research and development in the field of new energy has been recognized globally and widely used. For example, new energy fire extinguishing technology, photovoltaic technology, wind power generation technology, and lithium battery technology are all innovative achievements of China. In particular, the battery technology of electric vehicles has become one of the highlights of China's new energy technology. The blade battery technology and CTP technology developed by China have attracted widespread attention around the world. With China's breakthrough in the field of new energy vehicles, these advanced technologies have also been gradually applied to the field of marine transportation. China has successfully developed electric LNG carriers, pure electric deep-sea probes, methanol-powered ships, and dual-fuel container ships, and has begun to receive orders from other countries. What's more exciting is that China is now bringing these new energy technologies into the field of mining transportation. As early as 2018, China had already started the research and development plan of new energy mining truck. Faced with the situation that fuel mining truck dominated the market at that time, and the application challenges of new energy mining truck in complex mining environment. China formed a special team composed of mining truck chassis technology experts and new energy technicians to overcome technical difficulties. After nearly a year of hard work, 
China successfully launched the world's first 120-ton pure electric mining truck and successfully achieved mass production. In subsequent tests, the performance of this pure electric mining truck far exceeded expectations. Compared with traditional fuel mining trucks, its energy consumption is only one-third of that of fuel vehicles, and the comprehensive transportation efficiency has increased by more than 25%. However, 120 tons of load is not actually large in the field of mining truck. Therefore, in 2024, China continued to take greater steps and began to develop ultra-large pure electric mining trucks. So, how powerful is this large electric mining truck independently developed by China? In August this year, China announced that it had successfully developed the world's first 220-ton large-scale mining dump truck pure electric transformation and completed the vehicle installation in the Bay Rixile open pit coal mine, entering the commissioning stage. According to the information obtained, the coal mine previously had 35 traditional fuel mining trucks, consuming more than 16 million liters of fuel each year. In addition to the huge fuel expenses and maintenance costs, the more troublesome thing is the exhaust emissions of these mining trucks, which seriously pollute the local air quality. In order to achieve resource conservation and intensive recycling, China decided to carry out pure electric transformation of 220-ton mining dump trucks. This transformation is based on the chassis of the SF33900 220-ton dump truck, and chooses to use lithium iron phosphate power batteries instead of traditional diesel engines as the driving source, realizing the full electrification of the vehicle. In order to ensure that this mining truck can operate stably in extremely cold environments, the technical team has developed a customized insulation system for the power battery, specifically for the climatic conditions on site. In addition, the technical team has also developed a set of domestically produced AC control cabinets, which enable efficient energy-saving control of the vehicle's ventilation system, hydraulic system, air conditioning system, and other auxiliary equipment. It is worth mentioning that this electric mining truck is equipped with a 3-megawatt charging pile, which can quickly charge the battery pack within one hour, ensuring that the vehicle can work continuously for more than eight hours greatly improving the operating efficiency. In contrast, the energy cost of the modified pure electric dump truck has been reduced by 40%, reducing carbon emissions by 800 tons per year. Moreover, the annual operating cost of a single vehicle can save about 210,000 US dollars. In addition, the battery, motor, and electronic control system of this pure electric mining truck can also maintain stable power output in the harsh environment of lack of oxygen. But you may not know that this three electric system is designed according to higher safety and technical standards than new energy buses. After years of market verification of 190,000 commercial vehicles, its safety and reliability are fully guaranteed and the vehicle attendance rate exceeds 95%. It is understood that this mining truck is even similar to a family car, equipped with a series of intelligence systems such as 360-degree surround view system, anti-collision warning system, anti-drowsiness system, tire pressure monitoring, weighing and energy management, etc., to achieve comprehensive digital monitoring. It is worth noting that since China released this pure electric mining truck, it has attracted great attention in the mining field. Even some British media pointed out that this mining truck developed by China may make European and American countries nervous. So, what is going on? According to my investigation, China, as a country with very rich coal resources, has a huge demand for mining machinery. Traditional mining dump trucks usually use diesel engines as a power source but the global market is mainly dominated by manufacturers in the United States and Germany. For example, Caterpillar of the United States is the world's largest manufacturer of construction and mining equipment, with a market share of 59.62%. Caterpillar has long invested in the Chinese market, continuously launching new hydraulic excavators and electric loaders, and has occupied 38% of the country's market. 
In addition, German mining truck manufacturers also occupy about 10% of the Chinese market. Therefore, European and American countries have been using these advantages to suppress China's mining industry, resulting in long-term restrictions on China's procurement of complete machines, supply of accessories, and overhaul. Now, once China's independently developed pure electric mining truck vehicles are put into large-scale use in China, these restrictions in Europe and the United States will no longer pose a threat to China. More importantly, European and American countries may lose this huge market share of mining truck vehicles in China. According to national estimates, the pollution emissions of a fuel-heavy truck are equivalent to 300 cars, while a 100-ton wide-body mining truck has four times the carbon emissions of a heavy truck, equivalent to 1,200 cars. From this perspective, if a 200-ton or 300-ton mining truck is used, the impact on the environment will be huge. Of China's total carbon emissions, 14% comes from the transportation sector. And of this 14%, 85% is generated by heavy trucks and mining trucks. Therefore, promoting the green and low-carbon transformation of mining trucks is the only way to achieve carbon emission reduction in the mining industry. Compared with traditional fuel mining trucks in Europe and the United States, if countries around the world want to accelerate energy transformation, then China's pure electric mining truck is undoubtedly the best choice. Previously, the British media released a report titled Electric Vehicles in Mining Industry 2024 to 2044, Technology, Participants and Forecasts, which conducted an in-depth analysis of the fast-growing electric mining truck industry. The report points out that the giants of the global mining industry generally prefer electric mining trucks and predicts that by 2044, the electric mining truck market will grow to more than 23 billion US dollars, with a compound annual growth rate of 32%. This means huge economic benefits for China and also poses a severe challenge to traditional fuel mining truck manufacturers in Europe and the United States. Although Australia is also developing electric mining trucks, China, as the first country to enter this field, began exporting pure electric mining trucks as early as 2019. Today, China accounts for 80% of the global pure electric mining truck export market. Data shows that more than a dozen countries, including Brazil, Mongolia, and Belarus have successively purchased China's pure electric mining dump trucks. So, do you think that China's pure electric mining trucks can replace Europe and the United States in the market? To not miss out on our future projects and news updates, please make sure you subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications. We will continue to provide you with more exciting and interesting content.